Good morning, B Squad. Welcome back to another episode of Say Mama V Girl TV. Wow, V Girl TV. Welcome back guys, welcome back to my canal de YouTube. It is a beautiful morning, right mamas? We are up early, Amir is supposed to be in school right now but we got stuck in New York because my passport came late but we are packing, I gotta pack cause we are going back to the PTY, thank God, okay? We are thrilled to be, to be able to be going back home but um, we're in a dilemma guys look at this room so i literally did laundry <clears throat> and i am going to pack i had bought some stuff for amir and i also bought some stuff for the baby to take back with me um i didn't really i got a couple of things for me but i really didn't most of the stuff were for the kids welcome to my mommy landia where it's no longer about you um so i didn't really buy anything for me mostly all the clothes and everything that i bought was for the kids um, and I'm trying to see if I can condense everything in here, okay? What's you, baby girl? I'm trying to see if I can condense everything in here um, so I don't have to pay for an extra suitcase or even if I do have to pay for an extra suitcase, I only have to pay for one. So I bought, let me show you what I bought. Hold on, guys. Well, let's put Gigi in her little chair so that I can show you guys what I bought and what we are going to attempt to do. Okay, mamas, you are going to sit in the big girl chair. Um, I swear this looks worse than what it really is. I ended up buying the Ultimate Space vacuum storage bag. Um, I want to see if I can actually free up some space in the suitcase before I go out and buy two extra suitcases and then have to pay for two extra suitcases. Um, this, I've seen a lot of travel influencers use this. It's supposed to be the top of the top. Um, I got this off of Amazon and I paid about $22 for it and it's supposed to create up to 80% extra storage space, right? So this is the first time that I'm opening it. Let's see what it comes with. This is, I got the one that has 20 bags. So it has four jumbo bags, four large bags, four mediums, four smalls, and then travel roller bags, okay? I am going to, I'm going to assume that this is the way that you're, what's the matter mama? And it comes with a hand pump vacuum um, to take the air out. So, guys, we're going to be using this together. Alright, so, let's see. This is, I have never used this before. I'm going to assume that these are the medium sized bags. Um... gonna put that there I'm gonna actually start with the stuff that's already folded in the suitcase guys if this works out then this will be like life hacks okay life hacks I want to start with the jumbo bags um because we have lots of jeans wow look at this all right so I'm gonna actually start with the jumbo bags okay um, let me actually read the instructions because I hate trying to figure things out and I don't even know what the heck I'm doing. Okay, so it says compress, protect, organize, no mold, mildew, or bacteria. Our vacuum storage bag means you won't have to worry about long-term effects. Of and this video isn't sponsored, by the way. I literally was trying to figure out a way how I can uh, be a smarter traveler um, because me and my kids, we like to travel, Okay. Gia's just got here, but she doesn't realize that she's going to learn to travel, too. Um, all right, so it says, pack the items. Um, pack. Items should be completely dry before packing. 
for the long-term storage seal gently with the zipper slider I don't see a zipper slider here oh okay um yeah oh this is the zipper slider guys it already comes attached with the with the zipper slider I know some of them come with the zipper sliders that are separate um and then it says remove the air valve vacuum on the bag vacuum up the bag from the vacuum and then close the valve all right so it seems pretty easy let's start I'm actually gonna start with the clothes that's on the bed because it's actually the most and most of the clothes that's on the bed is all Gigi stuff um she I'm literally just gonna take out we don't have any plans for the week uh, Monday to yeah we don't really have any plans um for the rest of the remaining time that we're here so I'm just gonna take out what she's gonna wear to go on the plane and like onesies and stuff and then everything else I will pack up all right change of plans I'm actually gonna start with Amir's clothes because they're already packed and I happened to pull out this jumbo bag so I'm gonna use his his clothes is already folded so it would make sense for me to use this or whatever so I'm gonna open this up Okay, clearly I'm going to have to like leave all this because which one is the okay I get it now so according to instructions we have to like literally fold everything I hate folding clothes by the way so if there's someone that has like serious OCD in the comments that's watching and you know I'm not folding right please don't try to come for me okay because I'm letting you know from right now that this is not folding is not my thing honey y'all I really hope that this product is as good as everyone on the internet you know Beyonce's internet be lying I hope that it's as good as it says it is because as you can see this this particular suitcase was filled up to the brim literally it was filled up to the brim all right guys this is the moment of truth I'm not sure this in itself is like super heavy so I'm not sure if I put too much in here but we should we'll see so it says that I have to seal it. All right. This is the moment of truth, y'all. I know, right? Gigi is in the corner like, Ma, what are you doing? Got all this plastic for no reason. This is a workout. Oh my God, y'all. So I just pumped the first bag and it literally, okay, I'm gonna show you this because, by the way, I am not getting sponsored for this video. Okay, this is not sponsored. Y'all, I showed you what it looked like before. This is what it looks like now. Okay. And let's see how it fits in the suitcase. Totally, okay. Guys, there's so much more space. So, when I showed it to you before, um, the suitcase was filled on top to the brim. And now I can actually fit in more stuff. Um, I'm supposed to be able to roll it, but I think I put too much um, clothes in this one bag, so I wasn't able to roll it. So, 
So I know for the next one that I'm that I'm gonna do, I'm gonna actually like fold it thinner and like leave it flatter. Um, but guys, I'm super impressed. So let me finish packing up and I'll show you the rest because I know you don't really want to see all the other stuff. So right, Gigi. Right, Gigi. Yeah. You gonna help mommy pack? I guess that's a no. So guys, as you can tell, I have so much clothes that I still have not um, packed, but I am making progress. Let me show you. So um, don't mind the mess, cause I'm literally trying to, this is like dirty clothes over here. But this is some of the clothes that I'm packing. And this is two bags of clothes that I was able to shrink. And I still got all of this to go. But we're making progress. I had ordered groceries from Instacart. Um, and so it's here now. We're here for a few more days. So yeah, so we're here for a few more days. So I wanted to get some groceries. Oh, much better. I wanted to get some groceries so that we can eat and I can cook while we're here. Of course, you know, I got my LaCroix. I got some stuff to make salad. Just a few things, some salmon to eat. I didn't go really, I didn't go crazy crazy, but I just got a few things. So I'm making Amir and I a burger for lunch because we got a lot to do today. Like, so much stuff to do today. I got some Gatorade because I'm super dehydrated. I don't usually drink Gatorade, but because I'm breastfeeding, I'm always like really, really thirsty. And even with me drinking water, it just seems like it's still not enough. So I just feel very dehydrated. And I end up getting this bread for our burgers. I wish they had this in Panama. I'm gonna look to see if they have this in Panama. I doubt it though but um, it's Dave Killer's bread. 21 whole grains and seeds, burger bread. I uh, wish I could take this back with me, I really do. And then I got some cashews, cause cashews also help with the milk supply. And I love cashews, they taste so good. So I got actually two because I go through one of these in like one day. And I think I have got coconut water, so I'm gonna put away these groceries. I need a pump, I haven't pumped all day. I just been putting her on my breath. But I need a pump and yeah so i'm gonna continue putting away these groceries and making something for us to eat and i'll be there y'all i'm using this burger bubba burger um patties they have this in panama i've tasted this before and it's really good so i didn't actually buy this today we had this in the freezer for a while so i'm gonna just use it you know we don't want to waste food we don't need to waste food food is expensive nowadays y'all I ordered avocados, right? So in the picture, because I did Instacart. Gia, what is happening over there? So yeah, I did Instacart, right? So in the picture, everything, let me put on these lights because it's kind of dark and I want you guys to see this because I'm appalled, okay? By the level of disrespect, hold on. So, let me place you guys down so I can give you guys the full, the full, we all over the place right now, but hold on. Your girl is coming. Your girl is coming because this deserves, this deserves a, cause I can't believe it. So I ordered avocados, right? Because I need to, as you guys know, like when I'm in Panama, I eat super clean, I eat super healthy. And, sorry, Gigi's right here in her stroller. And since I've been here, I haven't been eating, I haven't been eating the way I should. So now that I'm going back to Panama, I want to start getting my body accustomed to eating the things that I usually eat when I'm in Panama, right? So I ordered avocados, right? It was $6 for the avocado, which is super expensive for me, but whatever. This is what it looks like. So there is one, two, three, four small itty bitty teeny meeny avocados in here for $6, damn near $7, okay? Do you know in Panama, I can get three humongous um, avocados de mantequilla. They call them butter mango, butter mangoes, butter avocados for $5. This this is a slap in the face. <laughs> This, 
Let me know, guys, do you eat avocados and how much do you guys pay for avocados wherever you at? So wherever you are watching, let me know how much it costs for avocados because this level of disrespect, they could have kept this. They could have kept this, honestly. So guys, I just finished eating. So I'm gonna go back to packing. It's, what time is it right now? It's one right now. And I have a doctor's appointment virtually at four. And then I also have to cook dinner. Um, I wanna try to finish doing all this in the next hour. So I'll be back guys. <laughs> 